Hello and welcome to a new video. So in this video, just how to adjust my seating. This video will be going to my vinyl collection. And trust me, ugh, there's a lot. I've been collecting vinyl since uh, 2018. And there's a whole bunch in here and there's even more in my apartment in Oslo. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. Okay, so the first this is in no partic particu particular order. Um, <laughs> I'm nervous about this. This is my collection. Uh, I'm very, you know, <laughs> secret about my collection. I don't know why. I feel like most vinyl, vinyl collection collectors are. I can't speak today. And my neighbor is mowing the lawn, so if you hear that, I'm sorry, but I can't do nothing about it. <laughs> the first one we have here is uh, Fan Fantastic by Wham. I think everybody knows who Wham is. If not, go listen to them on Spotify. The fur. Got this at the thrift store uh, last summer. And I've listened to it like one or two times and yeah, it's good. I mean, it's 80s pop. I'm not really that much, that big of a fan of pop music, but this is 80s pop, so it's okay. And here, second one, is recordings of Marilyn Monroe, uh, her songs and uh, some stuff from her movies. Um, I think this is rare. I found another trip store, the same one I found this at last year. This one was pressed in uh, 1976 by RCA Records. Here we have Sia. Sia, yeah, I'm saying that right. Uh, 1000 Forms of Fear. This is a really good album. Um, wig. Uh, yeah, and it's even better on vinyl. I recommend you get yourself this one. And here we have Lady Gaga with Joanne. This is my favorite album by Lady Gaga. Um, and it's really, I mean, I think most people have heard some songs, like Million Reasons. Uh, it's really folk inspired and it's not really country, which what they say it is, but it isn't. It's pop influenced by folk music. But yeah, it's, it's good. My favorite song on here is Angel Down. And here we have another Lady Gaga album, Fame. I won this in a contest on Instagram last year. And uh, yeah, this is not my favorite album by her, but um, I think everybody knows most songs on this, so I mean, Iconic. And then, <laughs> yet another uh, Lady Gaga album, but also Bradley Cooper, the A Star Is Born soundtrack. I bought this after I saw the movie in 2018, and there are a lot of good uh, songs on here. We also have some stuff from the movie. Uh, so yeah, it's good. Here we have Alone of the Way with her best album, Honeymoon. There are a lot of good songs on here, my favorites song on here is probably God Knows I Tried. Here we have Billy Idol with 11 of the best uh, songs um, back in 1988 as it says here and here we have some of his hits and I mean yeah he's a good rock artist I like it it's cool found it at a thrift store so yeah Bob Marley um, oh. And uh, Bob Marley with Con Confrontation, and uh, yeah, that's good. I have something in my eye. The Rolling Stones, and uh, yeah, these are some of their greatest hits in the period of 1964 to 1971, and yeah, that's good. And next one up. Molly Cyrus with Young and Al. I bought this, uh, I pre-ordered it when she announced the album, but I didn't get it until like February, February, February 2018. 
uh, which was really strange because this album came out in uh, September 2017 and I got it in 2018. But you know, what can you do? This is a good album. Uh, mostly pop, some country influences here and there. But yeah, we have Rolling Stones. Wait, oh fuck. Uh, oh yeah, Dirty Work. It's a good album. I've only listened to it like two or three times, but yeah, it's good. Along the way with her debut album, Born to Die. Uh, this is mainly pop, alternative pop. Uh, and I, uh, you know, it's a good album. Uh, it's not my style right now. I liked it a few years back. But, I mean, these are good songs, they're hits, they're bops, they're iconic. Harry Styles, with Harry Styles. I got, it. I got this for Christmas in 2018, my twin sister gave this to me. And yeah, it's a really good album. Uh, my favorite song on here has to be... Mm, oh, what is it? Is it... Uh, ever Since New York, Long About Way with her EP, Paradise. And yeah, I like the, I like the uh, aesthetic of this album. It's really cool. Um, and there's really nothing much to see here, but I just really appreciate the simplistic, but uh, cool packaging. Luca, look at her, look at her. Yeah. Um, I've only listened to this a few times. My favorite song on here has to be Got My Way. Yeah. This one I got at a thrift store last year. Don't know why I picked it. It looked interesting, but it's just um, acoustic guitar instrumentals. So, yeah, and there's a cool backstory of this guy here. So, yeah. Bob Marley and the Wailers. Um, with Kaya. Yeah, it's a good album. Uh, my favorite song on here has to be Some is Shining. Then, last but not least of this part of the collection is uh, Pink Floyd with flowers and vegetables. Um, they, I mean, there's just some demos and some rare songs and studio recordings on this. I got it on uh, Facebook Marketplace. Camera turned off. That's a bummer. But uh, yeah, that's um, most of my vinyl collection. Uh, I have some, the vinyl that I have in Oslo is um, Pink Floyd with the wall, the wall, and Miley Cyrus with Nothing Breaks Like a Heart uh, with Mark Ronson, Nirvana with some studio recordings and some demos and stuff and I think that's it yeah uh, have to think thank you for watching this video uh, remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it and please comment down below uh, what your favorite vinyl is if you want to uh, yeah I love vinyl and I love you have a nice day